What up, peeps? Brocky's back, baby. Um, it's another cocktail for y'all. This is something uh, different and interesting that I found online. It's called the Applejack Rabbit. So we're gonna make this cocktail. It's pretty simple. You should be able to make it at home. I'm really curious about um, how it's gonna turn out. So Whiskey and Kicks is back at it again. And y'all rock with me. So first things first, you know how we do it. I'm gonna show y'all this uh, Applejack Apple brandy that I picked up today uh, just for this cocktail. I hope it tastes good. I heard about it before. And it's gonna have fresh orange juice. You see that? You see that? You, know, you see how I do around here? You know what I mean? Um, same here with this lemon. Fresh lemon juice. And this is what really brought me in to really wanting to try this cocktail. Pure maple syrup. Now, the recipe calls for um, grade B, but I couldn't find grade B, so I got grade A. So I'm gonna find grade B and then see how, you know, see the difference between the two. But we're gonna try this thing out one way or another. So this cocktail is shaken, and you guys know how much I love shaking cocktails. I don't love shaking cocktails. Um, Two ounces of apple brandy. Let's get right to it. See what this thing is all about. Two ounces of apple brandy. And one. I had a bottle of apple brandy. I had um the uh, Republic Restorative stuff, but I gave it to Andrea when we shot our um, sipping with Rocky uh, episode just a couple days ago. I gifted that to her. Hopefully, she's enjoying it. I had a little bit of a spill there, but it's cool. It's just a little dash. All right, so that's the apple brandy. Let me sit this to the side a little bit so y'all can see what's happening. Uh, I'll put it over here. And then we need uh, three quarters of an ounce of fresh lemon juice. So I'm gonna cut that a little bit towards the bottom, not quite in the middle, to make sure I get three quarters of an ounce. Let me see here. My measuring situation going. Three quarters of an ounce of lemon. Uh, gotta make sure it's clean. All right, here we go. The lemon juice in there. Mm -hmm. Three quarters of an ounce, right there. Let's get that in there, and then. Three quarters of an ounce of orange juice, fresh orange juice. I have a, I have a, a bottle of orange juice in the fridge, but I'm gonna go with the fresh orange juice. We're gonna get that right out the orange, baby. That lemon out of there. Oh, you know what? It's kind of, kind of big to go in there. So let me cut this again. Figure this out. Let's get a little bit more juice in here. There we go. We are right there. Yep. Yeah. Man, I'm glad I um I set up a um what is it called? The apple cider vinegar trap for my for these fruit flies that I had in the house from the last time I made a cocktail. I mean they got they went crazy. I guess some fruit got down to the sink and they went nuts and um I trapped all them joints. I'm glad I caught them before I made this video because they would be all over this right now. Let's get that into the cocktail. And how much um, how much syrup do I need? Half an ounce of grade B maple syrup, but we have grade A maple syrup, so we're gonna make it work, baby. Half an ounce. Turn that over. Get my half ounce popping off. I love maple syrup and cocktails. It is just awesome. All right, get that down in there. That's beautiful. That's good. And uh, we're gonna get some ice and then we're gonna shake this thing up and I'll be right back. All right, got the ice in there. Cut that thing off and just shake it up. going to a coupe glass. I have my glass in the freezer right now. Getting chilled. It's nice and cold by the time we get done with this. This is cold. Alright. 
There we go. <sighs> Let's get this coupe glass. Oh, yes. You see that? Oh, yes. And we're going to strain this puppy. No garnish. Strain it right into the coupe glass. This is going to be a quick video today. Oh, this is so cold. Right to the top, three ounces. Look at that thing. Look at that. Oh, that's nice. We're gonna get this camera up so y'all can see me taste this thing. And let's see what we think about it. I'm gonna be honest about it too. Let's go. All right, here we go. This is the Applejack Rabbit. Um, apple brandy, fresh orange juice, fresh lemon juice, and maple syrup. The good kind, not the, you know, we love the Aunt Jemima's and all that good stuff, but this is not, it's not about that. Let's taste this thing and see what it's like. Ooh. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Do I ever not like cocktails? I mean, hold on, let's see. That's nice. I would make this for friends. I'll, I'll have this myself. This is really nice. I like this. Yeah, the apple, the apple brandy is really disguised in this cocktail. You get a little bit of the um, the maple syrup coming through because you know the the orange and the lemon is very citrusy, and that sweetness kind of makes its way through. Let me get one more sip before I take pictures of this thing for my social media. Mm-hmm. I can rock with it. Apple Jack Rabbit, y'all. Make it at home, man. Let me know what you think. Um, follow me. Whiskey and Kicks underscore IG. Whiskey and Kicks on Facebook, YouTube. Please like, subscribe, follow, recommend. Um, and uh, we out here, man. Stay tuned for some big things coming soon. I've been working, man. I've been working. So we'll see how everything turns out. And I'm pretty sure it's going to be pretty dope. So I'll see y'all next time. Next cocktail. Let me go ahead and do my social media thing with this. And get this out to the people as soon as possible. Y'all be good.